So, uh, I lost my earbuds, my earplugs, earplugs, when uh, we were coming home from Laconia. Yep, I put them down when I was filling up gas at a gas station, and I put them on my seat, I think, and then, of course, I filled up with gas. We were kind of in a rush. I got back on the bike, and I took off, and then probably about five minutes later, I was like, oh, I realized I don't have my earbuds in, earplugs in, and uh, gone, gone. Um, so anyways, uh, these folks here, I'm not even, I, I wear, a wear, a, I, I wear, were, you guys see it here, right? Uh, more than quiet noise reduction earplugs. Um, so I'm very, very happy that they decided to reach out and ask if I'd like to try out their, their, um, earplugs because I've, uh, lost mine and I, I'm happy, happy to try out another pair. So today we're going to look at their website. Check it out and then of course we're going to take a look at these and uh we will continue the video when it's a little nicer outside i'm gonna go for a motorcycle ride and uh see see how they do okay so here it is uh more than quiet now i think these come in a uh, different color so you get this blue color and you get the kind of i want to say peachy color yellowy color but I think it's designed so that when you have it in your ear, you may not see it. It may not be as obvious because it's a little more like uh, of a skin tonish, right? But it kind of has that nice earbud type feel. And then something that's going to kind of stop it from going like too far in your ear would be my guess. It says it can reduce anywhere from 27 to 33 decibels. That's that's good. Um, and that's, is that all it kind of says? Is that it? Is that all it's telling me about? Right, you have a shop now. So $25, yeah, so you get a, either a blue pair or uh, this, I don't know what, what you want to call it, cream skin color, I don't know. You can't even call it skin color because it's not everybody's skin color, right? But sort of-ish my skin color, I guess. Um, weighing less than one gram, nice. Soft silicone contour and ear tips for extra comfort. A exquisite carrying box. Now I do like that because the pair that I lost, um, one of the reasons that I lost them is I didn't have a good carrying box. So I ended up not using the carrier box because it, it fell apart and uh, then I lost them. Oh, so they call it peach orange. That's a weird color. Uh, small, medium, large, three size of ear tips provided and a one year warranty. I don't know how you would break them. Just realize it's not going to be a warranty in regards probably to loss. 25 bucks US, that's not a horrible price, right? Not a horrible price. Uh, and this is this is them. A A where? A where that is my camera really that not straight? That's better. Um there you go. Comfort, suitability, sustainability. -hoo -hoo. Okay, and this opens with this. Yes, yes. Okay, so my guess is that's 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 them. Okay, and that's the tips. You know, what what more what more do you want, right? Just the tips. <laughs> okay. Let's grow up, Greg. Just grow up. I don't know if you can read this cuz I really can't. That needs to be larger for sure. Uh that is unreadable. I have no zero way I could read that. Uh, you do get, these are going to be, they talk about small, medium, and large. So you want to make sure, of course, that you pick the size that fits. If not, you know, it's not going to give you any noise reduction. Well, it may give you some, but it's not going to give what it's supposed to. And this is, this is having issues coming out. Okay, here we go. Yeah, this is just like, you know, your, your traditional, what I would have liked to have seen in some like actual like music earbuds, you get these little holders that have like the pairs set up on them. That would be nice. Cause these are, they're just kind of loose, but you know, there's your small, medium, large. It's all just kind of floating around there. That's, that's them. Yes. Yeah. So cool. Again, would like to maybe see them have a nicer, not just loose like that. Oh, that's a nice case. Hey, I like that. Simple. Shouldn't break. Uh, one thing I would like to see, and I don't know why nobody has thought of this, like none of the big guys. Um, I would, it's simple. I just want some way or something to like hook 
like a keychain, like a carabiner onto this so that I could, you know, hook them onto my key ring. That's what I want. You make something like this, but have this so I can hook a carabiner on it, so I can hook it onto my keychain, so that they're with me all the time. When I turn my bike off, I can take them out, pop, pop, right in my keychain. I'm good. I'm not going to lose them. Is that that difficult? It seems to be difficult, but yeah, that's that's nice. How do you open them? There's a there's a button on the no, that's not a button. That's just maybe design. There's a little flip. Okay, so there you go. It's it's. You, you can see it, right? And it's an abundance, right? Which I, you know what? I like because I don't want something that you have to fiddle around to put them in there. I want to be able to just boom, boom, drop it on the table. Boom, boom, put them in here, close it up. Good to go. Yes? Wow. Slippery. Okay, well, that's, uh, I don't know what size these are. Uh, but I do like the kind of backing, yeah? That's all right looking. Not that that should matter. Am I sitting weird? I got my camera's way over here and I'm over here. I got to readjust this. Anyways, uh, let's let's put them in. I don't know if this is the right size. This is something that, you know, trial and error. But it, as far as most of them, what I do is the pointy arrow, I kind of put like like so, like top. So I'm just going to kind of just, ready? Does that feel right? Spin it around, get it in my ear hole. Seems, seems legit. Okay, just get it in there, spin it, right? Just get it in and you spin. You get it and you spin. Yes? See them in there? The nice thing is, is like, you really can't... And it takes out just a certain, like it's a certain frequency, right, that it's taking out. Hmm. Comfy, for sure. I may actually wear them this weekend, because we're going, we're going ATV in. And uh, this may be nice because, yeah, there are, I just got to, I'll play with the sizes just to make sure I get the right size. But I do like the fact that like they, they go right, you guys see that? They go like right in there, but it's like, you, you can't really tell, right? That you're wearing, wearing ear protection and they should be able to come out nice and easy. All right. So again, just kind of get them in there and you spin them so that, that they, that they're, that they're in. Yes. Yeah, that's it. All right. Uh, so far, so far, I like them. So far, I like them. They're definitely comfy. And what I need to do now, take them out, take them out of my ears. Uh, what I need to do now is uh, take them for a ride. So stay tuned. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you know uh, my thoughts after uh, I go for a ride. Okay. So number one, uh, I'm trying these new Amazon cheap. <laughs> batteries for the one x2 because i'm cheap yeah um and i'm gonna go for a quick ride to try these out uh i am gonna be wearing my half helmet because when i wear a three or a three quarter a full face helmet um the helmet itself helps keep some of the sound away so i figured this is the best test i'll just take my bike and uh do my standard little loop you guys can watch i guess i'll play i'll play some video of the ride uh but really for me we're gonna tell i do i really do wish they made some kind of keychain -y thing for this you know maybe i just need to come up find something that i can get on my bike that's like a little pocket that i can just pocket stuff i know they make them for other bikes maybe they make them for this that would be night nice it would be night it's day it's hot holy hell I'm in the shade right now, which is super nice, but we're driving the convertible, the convertible right there or earlier. And uh, I almost was like, I got to put the top up just so I can put the air conditioning on. <laughs> it's hot. All right, let's go for a ride and test these out. That's my pull up my pants dance. Oh, yes. Okay, so that was that was super fun, uh, and I have to say, we'll probably talk about it more, but for some reason, whatever frequency these are taken out, you know, whatever hurts, you know, between the low low lows and the highs, um, my bike just sounds awesome, really does. It is 
I don't know, most most motorcycle like earplugs, and I know these aren't motorcycle earplugs, really have a tendency to try to remove like a lot of the low end, which is your motor noise. Uh, these, that seems to be the sound that they let through. So you lose a lot of like wind noise for sure, because of course it's plugged, right? Which is for, for one, it's awesome. Um, but anything that's kind of that mid, mid to high is it kind of pulls out. So, uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, pr I'm pretty down, down with the sound. Now, if you're someone that is wanting the motor noise gone because your bike's really loud and you're going on a long trip and I get it if I was going on a long trip um I'd want something that kind of pulls that noise out a bit more and I would say probably nay to these because they're not really pulling out that that sound profile they're pulling out like I said a, a mid to a high um but for cruising around town getting that wind sound out and letting you hear your bike Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, one more test tomorrow, one more test. Okay, so uh, my last test that I kind of wanted to do was to take the earbuds. I, I put them in here somewhere. Too much stuff. Okay, and I'm gonna wear them with the top down because one of the things I find when I'm driving with the top down on the highway is that I get a lot of wind noise in my ears and uh, Maybe, maybe this will help. Maybe this will be the be all end all and something that I think is just awesome. So I'm going to put these in, travel back to Halifax. I got a two hour drive and uh, when we get back there, but you know, we got my glasses. Oh, all good. All right. Let's, uh, let's drive home. Okay. So I've been up all morning editing footage and playing, uh, with some stuff. But I wanted to just finish this video because uh, we shot the very last part of it yesterday. And the earplugs have very much, well, as to be expected, the same kind of effect when I was driving the car. So wind noise was gone. Well, not gone completely, but muffled, right? Toned down a lot, which was good. Um, you could hear, again, the car motor a little more. Uh, again, it must be in regards to whatever frequency or, or hertz or whatever it is that the earplugs are blocking. Um, but the the issue was, and probably the only issue actually, was that it also seemed to be taking away a lot of the sound that was in and around uh, where the music was playing. So I didn't test that on the motorcycle, but I definitely did test it in the car. So uh, both my music and motorcycle, both my music and wind sound, because again, I, my guess is those are in closer frequency to each other, maybe, um, were pulled. Uh, car motor sound sounded great, if that's what you're looking for. Uh, and then last but not least, uh, when, I, when I came home last night, I just kind of continued or tried them out in the house just to see how they were for pulling out just standard day-to-day -day sound. And that's probably where they're best. It's kind of suited for that. So uh, if you're looking for something that is going to be taking out mid and high range, I think that th they'd be good. If you're looking at something that's going to be taking out low end, so you want to get something for like riding, riding a motorcycle or riding an ATV or riding something with a lot of engine noise or anything like that, then I think you probably should be looking at something that's definitely more designed for motorcycle riding. Um, but for day-to-day -day use, great price, uh, seem to do the job really well. They fit good. I like the fact that they came with all the extra tips. I wish that they came with a holder or something for the tips, just so that you could keep them organized because I guarantee you for most of us, you'll lose those. Um, case was good. Again, I'd like to see something like a carabiner or something on the case so that you could hook it into your keychain or whatever it is so that you could carry these with you just so that they become a little uh, easier to locate. Other than that, yeah, decent. All right, guys, I'll put links below to where you can pick them up. And uh, that's all for me. Um, it's been a long couple days, so more videos coming. Alright guys, like, comment, share, subscribe, hit the little notification bell, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Later.